Hello and welcome to IP table symbol on task number one that we going to work on how using IP table in Linux to drop uh, on the packet uh, ICMP at layer number three from an IP address. In the scenario, an IP address here, I have an IP address that what I'm going to drop. Okay, that's my IP address, and then I got to drop into my Linux. So any packet, any any IP address, any ICMP pin packet arriving from this IP address will come to this IP address, will come to here, and will be dropped. Any other packets will be allowed. Okay, so only allow, only deny or drop a packet from this IP address only. Yeah. So anything come to here, anything come to here will be dropped. So that's and here is the the task. Alright, for more information on IP table that you can search on Google, search for IP table symbol that came out massively. Alright, a lot of IP table that you want to go. Or for that example here, allow incoming, and there is so many multiple ports there as well, so an outgoing SSH. Example, so in here you just search IP table rule example or original website from here. All right, netfilter.org. That's IP table. Uh, I believe it is a, an official website. So if you want to go learn more about IP IP table, and uh, very much it should apply to on top of router. Very much the same the similar uh, condition or rule. Okay, I come back to my example here, right? So I'm going to write the answer here, and then I copy and paste later. So a input from uh, from from what source? Anyone remember on my IP? So five six two oh four. So source is uh, five six six five two oh four. Okay. And destination. Uh, destination. Destination. That's input. That's all right. And on what protocol? ICMP. Yeah. And then jump jump for drop okay that's my rule so I'm going to copy this rule this statement into my IP table okay I copy this statement I put in my IP table see how it go so now no mm. so that where the IP table locate in centos in Ubuntu they slightly different okay okay now that's my IP table have a look at the moment I have that option there. I just take it off, right? I take it off. I make a comment, so I take it, disable them. And then I don't want to do anything with ICMB. I take it off there as well. And that rule there is also off. So no ICMP being enforced at the moment, right? So I'm going to paste the ICMP there. That's my new testing rule there. So Task, task one testing statement. Okay, save it and get out. And then before it's effect, you have to restart the IP table. Okay, that had to restart the IP table. So now I'm going to do a uh, measurement. Okay, a measure. So I have, uh, I'm, I'm going to measure, I'm going to run this command in Linux very much or, and see whether I can have any packet coming to my from window, right? So I'll go back to Linux now, run uh, tcp, tcp some icmp, right? I run that command there and then go to window and then I'm going to ping Uh, my server. Anyone know what my server IP address? Uh, that one. The one here. Can you help me out? Ten six five dog two oh four, right? Two four two four eight. One, two, three, go. One is nothing happened. So wait. Two, 
two, three, four. Should be four packs in total, right? So there is, have a look. Four packets been dropped from there is no successful. From window point of view, you see it's hundred percent loss, yeah? But in Linux you pick up the packet. You pick a couple of how many packets here from uh four oh uh two oh four. So how many packets people? One, two, three, four. Four packets from that. So what does that mean to you? In window lost hundred percent. This means that from window point of view, you see the linear is not exist. Are you follow? It's not exist at all. It lost completely. Yeah? But in in Linux you still pick the packet. So that how do you do the firewall? You don't want people to ping you. You don't want people to see that you're still alive. I mean your server your your service still alive are on the network. Does that make sense? So now you got I'm gonna change. I'm gonna change from drop to reject. Yeah? And you will see here loss probably zero percent. But there is no destination to be reached. Okay? So you, I'm gonna change the IP table again. And then I'm gonna change this to to what? Reject it. And then restart again. Go back over here and then I run the packet here again also. One, two, three, go, and then come back here, go. One, two, three, four. Okay, I stop here. So you got four packets arrived from here, right? And there is a return. The return called unreachable. Okay? And have a look, what do I lost? I lost nothing. Is what does that mean? It means that from from the user point of view, all the packet went through and all packet returned. Uh, sorry, no return. All right, but from that mean, from that zero percent loss, mean that on your packet delivery successfully, it means the destination host is on. Okay, so the next rule would be accept. So if you, if I do accept, you know what it's gonna be already. Yeah, accept. So I'm gonna change to accept. Ooh. Uh, restart IP table and then run them again. Now accept, right? Ping. One, two, three, four. Okay, then I stop. Now you analyze. You analyze over here, right? There is accept the echo request, alright. And remember be the one before? What was the one before? Unreachable. That for, that for one, that for rejects, right? But now for accept, there's a echo record, uh, echo reply. So now what you got to do to learn more information about this, all you got to do go into, uh, of course, uh, one of the site here, and search for um, I I C M P pub, and there is a massive pub somewhere. Um, should be from here and have a look number zero and number eight zero and number eight okay and there is an unreachable as well is number three is that all right so that how you 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 got to do with your IP table but if you're going to learn more about this you're going to re be really good into Cisco uh, any other not just Cisco and into networking generally you see the packet and you know what happening the top of pack, the, the top of packet, the top of the header, yeah, and then it return what it is. Okay, so for more information, you can play around with this and see how the echo reply or unreachable on that top of ICMP packet. All right, do it now. Play around with that. See how we go. Bye for now.